In this video, I'll show you some tips on how to save your research. When you're working on a research project, it's really helpful to collect all of the research that you find into one place so that you keep a running log of the articles, websites, books, etc. that you found for your research. So you'll see here that I'm using a Google Doc to collect my research, and I would suggest this for you as well. You might want to collect information such as a citation and a link to this article, as well as some notes as to why this was important for your research, and maybe some notes of things you wanted to remember to cite or include in your paper. So let me show you where you can find these pieces of information when you're using the library's databases. So once you've conducted a search and you've found some articles that you're interested in, click on the title and you'll find additional data about this article. There are two buttons on the right hand side that are really useful. The first is cite and this is where you can find the citation for your article. So look for the citation style. So if you were looking for APA, you'd want to copy this citation style and put this into your research log. Now I've just done a control V to paste that in and you may find this as well, that it comes in with a black highlight. It's just a part of the system. So if you actually paste without formatting, it will come in just fine. So if you have that problem, just paste special or paste without formatting and there'll be no problem. And it will actually take the text size and font that you've already chosen for your document. The second thing that we want to collect is we want to collect a way to get back to this article later. Don't copy the URL at the top here like you would a normal web page. This will not get you back to this article. What you want to do is on the right hand side, you want to click on permalink and this is a permanent link back to this article. Copy this link and paste it into your research log. So now you've got two important pieces of information. You know what the article is and you have the citation and you've also got the link to go back and look at it later for the library's website. Now include these things and it'll make your research a lot easier.